I don't know, it's a good question. Going down the road, what do you see? Smoke, 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 here we go smoke. I saw a fire, so I just decided to push the record. There's one right there, too. So I think they're burning the build. Oh, they're burning, they're burning the bushes, brushes. I don't know, it's a good question. Stuck in traffic trying to get out of the petrol for a very long time. There's plenty of people behind us, plenty of people in front of us, and we've been trying to get out for about 15 minutes right now. We were just over there at the Fuel Island. Kind of sucks. I know we haven't vlogged much lately, but this is Vanessa trying to get our next load taken care of so you don't have to worry. Hi Vanessa. Hi. How are you doing? Good. How was your weekend? Good. You happy from where we're heading to next? Yes. Where, you he where are we heading to? Uh, Texas. So they have us filling up 50 gallons at the yard, then Loves and Trim carrying Mexico 50. Loves in Wichita Falls, Texas. Wichita Falls, Texas? Really? That small place? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. two loves and then the yard. Okay, I'll figure it out. Anyway, <laughs> I'll figure it out. We are just about to leave. We're in Grantsville, Utah right now. And we're about to go to pick up our load uh, head to Texas again. But I'm going to update this a little bit more and post it today. And let's see what happens, okay? Love you all. Alright. <clears throat> yeah, 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 yeah. What's up, duck? Hi, honey. Hi. Anyways, I'm going to take this time to explain what happened since the surgery. Uh, as you all know, I got my breast augmentation done. Oh, there goes Lisa. Uh, Monday the 21st. And here we are working on week number three. I think it's week number three. Tomorrow will be the third week. And uh, I just want to explain to you, for being transgender with a tight top half, it is very hard to do the breast augmentation, but I'm. it still hurts. Not as bad as it did when I finally stopped taking the, uh, the pain medication that the doctor prescribed. But let's just say... Yeah, well, it looks good. Sorry about that. Let's just say it's a feeling that you have to get used to. <laughs> um, I have been beginning to get feeling back here, but down here I still don't have feeling back at all. Right underneath the, yeah, I don't know if I'm allowed to say that word, but it's right down here. I don't have feeling. It's like you could stick a needle down there, and I won't feel it. <laughs> which sucks. Um, I talked to my friend in Moapa, Nevada, and she said that she had the same thing done, but I won't get feeling back for at least another two months. Three months after the surgery, and I'm like, oh, are you serious? Three months. Can you believe that? Wow. But so far, they're doing pretty good. The thing I hate most is when you're driving down the road and then you have a spurt, like, right up here, it can just go like no pain at all and then the pain level jumps all the way to an eight and or a nine and then within two or three seconds later it goes back down so you're like uh, uh, <laughs> jumping but then it goes back down and then it quits for a couple of minutes and then it goes again on a different spot it's they separated the muscle and the skin they separated it like this <laughs> So the muscle is still down here, but the skin's up here, which 
makes it more of a feeling and make it makes it more uh, realistic and uh, the less of a of a problem healing he says that if he goes underneath the muscle then I'd be out of, I'd still probably be in a hotel right now because it'd be hurting so freaking bad but to all of the ladies or the transgender uh, people that are just like me that's out there who is interested in breast augmentation or breast reduction I done it almost three weeks ago I'm happy for what I see I wish they were a little bit bigger <laughs> but it it's kind of hard to explain I would do it if I were you it's Hey, you just moved my camera. <laughs> Bad girl. Love you. Love you too. <laughs> um, for breast augmentation, I would do it if I were you, but you have to realize the kind of pain. And that's what this part of the video is about. It's You have to realize what type of pain level you can handle. I can handle a lot of pain, but on occasion, it's the pain can go really high if you're not on the medicine. The doctors prescribe medicine. Um, healing process for me is still three weeks, but I've been able to wear a regular bra for about a week and a half now. I do switch back and forth, so it just depends on um, how your pain level is. Is depending on if you can wear a bra early or if you if you if you still have to wear the doctor's bra. Um, so yeah, I, I've been switching uh, on and off just depending on my pain level. Right now my pain as a, is a zero, but I just had two spurts of eight just a second ago and it did not feel good. But yeah, if, um, you know, the healing process is about, for the type of surgery I had, is about three months just to get filling back in your breast. So just an update. Um, if you guys are interested, I there is a doctor here in town that can do it. Uh, we're in Salt Lake, but my doctor's in Logan. So if you're from this area, just let me know and I can hook you up with uh, with my doctor. Okay. Um, yeah, that's all I want to say about the current situation with the breast augmentation. I'm doing good. I'm at a solid C cup right now, um, and I'm feeling a lot better than I did in the past. Now I just have to get my teeth worked on. And that's a pricey one. $10,000 I gotta come up with for that job. Anyways, I'm gonna switch you over to Vanessa because I want her to explain about her breast reduction surgery. I can't remember all of it and I'm busy. <laughs> Can you at least, you know, tell our viewers if what you did on your breast reduction was a good thing or a bad thing? It's a good thing if you're if you're up there in size. And do you ever ever regret ever getting them done? No. No. So if you were up there again, would you get them done again? Yes. Awesome. What what is your pain level now after six months? Zero. Zero. So you're okay with everything, right? Yep. Just have to work on uh, on uh, your hair, getting it more red than what it is. Look at it. <laughs> Love you. Love you too. Um, let's see. I'm gonna be the questionnaire right now because oh, I gotta pick up the phone because there's no one on the line to ask you questions. But on your breast reduction surgery, where you lost a lot of it. Is it a kind of surgery that you would recommend to other people that is big chested? Yes. Um, breast, uh, breast reduction surgery, would you do it again? In a heartbeat or you'd have to wait? I'd have to wait. Um, let's see, what else? I'm just trying to think about what these people would ask. <laughs> I still have two minutes before I can end this, uh, this version. Version. Go figure. <laughs> um, are you satisfied with the scars, or are you not satisfied with the scars that 
was created during for the surgery, and are you trying to get the scars to go away? I'm trying to get them to go away. Does it annoy you that you have the scars? No. So it is the scars that you have for your breast reduction surgery. Is it like a, a remembrance, whatever that word is? You know, um, like you don't ever want to get that big again. And, you know, I'm just trying to think here. I would never get that big again. Because of the scars or because you don't ever want to be that big? I don't want to see those sizes again. <laughs> Uh, if you can see the before and after picture, she looks a lot better now. <laughs> well, I love you. Love you too. Uh, I'm having another paint spur. Uh, I hate it. It's right down. It's right here. That's where it hurts. Anyways, um, yeah, you s you're going to get paint spurs for a while. Uh, do you recommend surgery on your breast reduction for people with big chested? Yes. So, 51 seconds. If um, you guys are interested in breast reduction surgery, just let us know in the comments down below and we'll hook you up with our doctor and see what's going on. Anyways, love you, honey. Love you too. All right, now that we are, I don't know if we're gonna keep on going tonight. We've been uh, doing pretty good today. We had to go to Brandsville and blah, blah, blah. Anyways, we are, the yard right now about to leave yeah I think we'll leave I don't know get further down the road it's not bad it is like 62 degrees outside not bad outside um, I would have to say I don't know should we just go after this I don't know neither do I <laughs> we're kind of at work. We're both airheads today because we don't know what the heck we're doing. Um, yeah, we're heading to Fort Worth, Texas. So our next vlog, our next video should be the trip to Fort Worth and back. But anyways, I'm going to end this vlog right now, okay? If you guys like these videos, like, subscribe, push the bell notification. Let you know when we upload another video. And I just sure hope that you all would have a great night, okay? Love you all. Bye.